Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to a new series that we're doing here on the channel. We're gonna call it, uh... We're gonna call it How to Play Twos. It's a new season. I've been really enjoying uh, playing some twos. So I thought I would cue some twos, talk about what I'm doing, decisions I'm making, stuff like that to help you guys understand. You guys love to let me know down in the comments if you enjoy uh, this idea or not. If you wanna see some twos on the channel, if you wanna see some threes, some ones, whatever it is, let me know down in the comments what you guys wanna see because I am more than happy to make whatever content you guys want. The playlist population is great, yet we are still queuing for a solid minute here. I don't know if that really means it's great. All right, finally into our first game here. Oh, feeling good, feeling warm. I also, uh, it is peak allergy season for me, so we are, uh, we're pretty congested. Probably not gonna sound great, but it is what it is. Looks like we got Camille up against Bad and Dot. Probably has a black picture as his profile. Yup, classic. Probably some pro. Pretty low boost here, ooh. Don't really love that touch. Big save from Camille though, we like that. Not a lot of boost though, so we're just gonna try and pad a little bit. Let Camille go. Big clear, now we're gonna get some pads. Camille might just have a read here. Ooh, just puts it off. I wanna try and take his corner. We don't get it, that's not optimal. So we'll get mid. Camille wants to cut in on that, that works. I'm not gonna go for that because Camille's over there as well. But I can. I should, probably should not have gone for that. That probably wasn't super smart. Let's just get back here, see if Camille hopefully has. Uh-oh. Ooh, yeah, that was kind of awkward. It looked like Camille was gonna try and uh, try and hit it over to me off the ceiling, but I think they will messed up. But right, we'll see what we can do. Try to get a good kickoff here. Nice, right to Camille, we like that. Camille plays ones. Should be able to slot this top right or bottom right, right into him. That's not what I wanted. I was trying to get a top right. That was uh, definitely a mistake on my end. Camille with the save, we love that. Looks like they're gonna over it, yup. Right to Camille. Oh my goodness. Good touch. Let's see if Camille goes for this. Looks like they're leaving it. I'm trying to just force a flick for Camille. Wasn't really up there though. That was weird. Try to just block a shot there. Let's see what we can do. Nice. That's a good beat. That's a good beat. A little bit of a 2v1 now. We want to see. Ah. It's kind of hoping they would go fast. Like if you have a two on one, you kind of want to try and capitalize. Looks like bad is up, but it's really awkward for him. It's kind of awkward for Camille, so we're just gonna get back. Bad is up. I'm gonna try and just win here. That was a good touch from uh, from Dot. Camille's got, so we'll just get some boost here. 30 in net, not too bad. Let's see, Camille. Give me something. Give me something. Give me something. That was risky to dive in, but I was, I was optimistic that I could get uh, a good challenge. Oh, couldn't quite get there for the demo. Looks like we're fine. And we got full boost. This might actually be open. Camille, you're insane. Nice one, Camille. I think right now I'm 1637, which I'm pretty sure is around Grand Champ 2. Um, we're just over a week into the season, so everyone's kind of all over the place with their rank. So I would guess the people that were playing were probably around Super Sonic Legend last season, just like, just like we were. But all right, I'm going to push up here. Kind of forcing Dot to go quick. Yep. Camille got a demo. I just need boost though. It's just bad, so we're really not too worried here. Uh oh, that's not optimal though. Nice, should we get it out? Probably not gonna jump for this because then I'd be very out of the play. And now Camille can go. See, yeah, like Dot kind of jumped for that and took himself pretty out of it. Anyway. Oh, Camille cuts. Oh, I didn't mean, that was a stupid touch. I wanna try and maybe get a bump here. Lift it. Ah, I thought he was gonna dive. Oh, Camille with the slot. Let's go. I thought that he was gonna dive into this, and so I tried to pop it, thinking that he would then get beat, but he stayed grounded. But Camille with the excellent shot. We love that. I'm trying to get a quick touch. Looks like Camille went mid. I did a quick, a quick. <laughs> I did a quick peek for my rear view. Uh, I'll do that sometimes if I solo queue twos, just to try and see where my teammate is going. Um, because sometimes you want to try and you know lose the kickoff to a certain side if your teammates go into that side or something like that but I'm just gonna try and control here you see i feel like a lot of people will uh kind of just give the ball away whenever they can you'll see them just like, kind of bang it out of uh, out of their net and a lot of times i think it's better to just kind of keep possession like right here i'm not gonna bang it i'm gonna slow play and you see someone coming in then you shoot it so he was there for the save but we got it by one instead of just kind of giving the ball away i don't want to overcommit here 
So I'm gonna overcommit and leave Camille in a, a sticky spot. Maybe get a demo on bad here. Ooh, couldn't quite get him. Hopefully Camille has something here. Nice. I'll let him stay with it. Try to play a net. Looks like he's getting bumped. It's weird for him though. Again, I'm just forcing a touch. Where will Camille go? I'm gonna grab this corner, I think. A minute left. We definitely definitely don't need another goal here, so we can just we kinda just wanna be smart. Try and get some pressure on him like that. Just gonna kinda play for a 50 now. Hopefully Camille's there. Nice. Kinda low though. Oh, I didn't get that boost. We'll take corner. Camille's turning. Which is good. That's a good beat. One to beat now. Let's see if maybe we get a demo. I win to this, so I'm gonna go fast. Oh, I thought I might win again. Alright. Kinda waiting for Camille to... Yeah, nice. Now, oh, I gotta hustle back though. Risky boost grab for me. Oh, no. We both missed. I'm going to go on the back wall because I think he might. Uh-oh. Nice. That was kind of scuffed. That's going to scuff. We made it work. Now we're definitely just trying to be smart. Keep possession. Kill time. That's up. This is, yeah, this is great from Camille. Just like the slow play. I'm just going to kind of fake challenge. Just have to sneak into the corner. I'm going to fake this. We'll just tap it over to the side. Get the dub. Good stuff. I feel like we did a good job that game of kind of like playing more slowly and kind of waiting for them to give away possession. Like that's what you want to do a lot. And twos, like you wanna you wanna clear the ball and you wanna hit it away, but there are definitely times where you want to control the ball and you want to play possession. I think that's really important because it can lead to good opportunities to flick the ball or pass it or whatever it is. Possession wins games. Game number two. Let's go. We got Knox, T Tomioka, and Elon Barney. Who's our teammate? We got Knox. I usually end up Get my kickoffs to go mid, or at least that's what I try to do. So I'm, I'm a big, big fan of trying to get a, a kickoff to go mid. But I want to play kind of close to Knox here. Probably don't want to dive. So he's going to hit it out to me. I'm trying to get it around. Ooh, that was a really bad push. I tried to get it around him. Obviously, it did not do well. Kind of let Knox go here. Again, I'm going to control this. Go for a quick flick. Nice. Yeah, like, see, like, I could have sent this away, but that would have just been giving him possession. So I kind of played it. Now it's a one-on-one. -on -one. I saw him come in here, so I thought if I got a good quick flick, then it might get, it might be too fast for him. That's exactly what happened. Possession wins games. I'm going to cheat. I really like going mid on kickoffs because it just gives you, oh, my goodness. Usually when you go mid on kickoffs, it gives you uh, a lot of opportunities for a follow-up, but you do run the risk of them, the kickoff going over your head like that. This is awkward, but I should win, so I'm going to hit it. Uh-oh. That was not an optimal touch here. I'm kind of just going to pressure. Oh, my goodness. Maybe hit it up to Knox. Nice. That was a good play. That was a little awkward. I didn't expect him to come in so fast when I caught it. And so he hit it over me. Then I kind of I tried to kind of pass it to Knox, and he was there for the, the shot. That was a good shot. Let's go. Good kickoff. I'm going to go for the other mid boost here. Oh, we're, we're going to miss the other mid boost. Knox is showing off the mechanics. Drops it mid. Let's go. I am going to cheat. Again, I like I like to cheat on kickoffs. So now I can cut him off here. Oh, that was a really good dunk from him, though. Nice play. I literally have no boost, though, so I got to try and grab a couple pads. That's another thing, too. If you don't, if you don't, if you can't get a big boost, it's okay. Like, don't panic. Just calm down, and there's probably, there's a lot more than you can do that you can do with a couple pads than you think. Like, I think a lot of people think they they have to have a full boost or they can't do anything whereas a lot of times you can do you can do a lot with just 20 boost i know nox is back so i'm just kind of going up here just kind of trying to wait didn't really get a touch on it but bumped him so nox has a little one-on-one -on -one now so he's going for a cool little flick it is off and i think he gets a touch so i don't want to commit looks like nox is turning i'm gonna fake this challenge just try to get him to depossess Kind of kind of got destroyed on that challenge, but that is what it is. He's trying to bump. I'm going to slow play a little bit. Oh, Knox is there. Nice. He really wants to show off the, the breezy flicks. Oh, almost got the dunk too. All right, he's probably going to try to go the distance here. Pretty awkward for him though. Hit to the side. Knox probably takes. We'll take the mid boost. <gasps> Where's my demo game? We better score this. We deserve it. Oh, let's go. Let's go. How did he not get demoed here? Thought we got that though. We deserved that goal. That was a good play. Good game. Game number three. We got Lunar Brawler who is reserved. Is he going to make it? He's joining. 
What a save from Lunar. Do we have Elon again? Do we have him last game? Was he on our team last game? I feel like he wasn't. We had... We had Nox on our team last game. So now we have Barney. I think Barney was the one that we should have bumped. But we somehow didn't get the bump. Ooh, that was a cool little touch. Let's see what uh, Lunar does here. I'm just going to fake challenge. Hit to the corner so that Barney can take. Not a bad touch. I'm going to fake this challenge. Try and get this now. Just clear it. I see Barney's behind me, so I'm gonna. I can't really pressure too much. Oh, nice! That's a good touch. I kind of want to get upfield here. Oh, oh! I think Barney. There we go. It's always awkward when you have low boost. Like I don't want to commit too much because then I'm really out of the play. But I still want to be involved and in the play. Lunar doesn't have him flip, so I can commit on this. I'm trying to stay behind the ball for a good 50, so that Barney can take it. Which he does. We like that. Lunar's up. I think he probably bangs. Yeah, we'll try to control. Oh my goodness. Got a decent 50, so hopefully Barney can just control. I'm gonna grab the corner boost. Crash, hopefully. Nice. I thought he was gonna go fast. Ah, I didn't get that boost. I'm gonna try and pass mid, maybe. Nice, that was smart from Barney to just get it around him. I'm kinda low, but again, I wanna stay up here. I don't wanna go for this, because I'm kinda last man right now, so I'm just gonna fake challenge. Maybe go for a bump. Hopefully he's got it. Nice. We'll let him stay here. We're good on boost. Nice from... Uh-oh. This is awkward. Yeah. That was kind of awkward from Barney. I think I had a decent... I think I had a decent line on this. And then he, he kind of got this little touch here. That kind of threw me off a little bit. But it's all good. He probably thought I was going to get bumped. Barney's there for that touch. We like that. A little bit of a one-on-one -on -one now. Should be able to slot it. Nice. Let's go. Good pass from Barney there. That was good of him to keep possession right here instead of flicking it. Kind of played the slow play. Got uh, got me a good opportunity to score, which is good. I'm going to try and take a peek. Oh, no. Oh, no. We messed up. Ah. Oh, I'm so sorry. That was so bad. Oh, I just completely messed up my flip. <laughs> oh, that's unlucky. That's unlucky, but it happens. There's nothing you can do about it. It's a good kickoff from Barney. I don't win to that boost, so we're just going to pad. Ooh, we're going to die, I guess. Hopefully, Barney has a save. Barney does not have a save. That is not optimal. That's okay. That was a good demo. I didn't even know he was close to me. Plenty of time left. Over three minutes. Two goals. Lots of time to right the ship. Lunar really going for all the boost here, so we should be able to get a touch. Probably going to go all the way back for the corner boost here. There's no way that's all. Wow, what a read. Alright. Nice. I thought he might pre-flip into that here. Kind of fake a bump. Hopefully Barney's got it. Nice. It's a really good touch. I'm going to control this. Ah, I tried to get a flick. I just didn't get the height on it. Whew. Probably could have been a goal there. I think he knows that too. Hop off, Barney. What in the... What are we doing? I'm just trying to win to this. Nice. Couldn't, didn't have the boost to follow it, though. Hopefully Barney's there. See what he does here. I don't love that he's centering it. Kind of hit it right to Lunar. I definitely don't have that nice. We'll take that, I guess. I don't have any boost, so I'm just trying to get a flick. Get the corner. Nice. Not a good touch. Ah, that was on me. I probably should have let Barney take this. I kind of, I came in on it and thought that I was going to pass it back to him, but then he stuffed it into me. Still got time though. Two minutes. Anything's possible. Kind of want to commit. Yeah, I thought he might get a touch. Probably just going to fake challenge here. Just drive up to the ball. Leave it. That's, uh, that's definitely something that you want to, uh, I would say keep in mind when you play is like, if you're like first man on the ball, a lot of times your role is to... Just kind of like force your opponent to do something. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm playing so bad. He wants to forfeit. I'm not letting him. We got four. We got four goals. Minute and a half. Anything is possible. Barney. Oh, Barney. Oh, what a save. All right, we got time here. We'll get this boost. Probably going to go low here. Oh, Barney. Oh, Trying to give him a pass. 
Up to Barney there. Oh, he wins. Read it, Barney. Probably beat. Yeah, I didn't have the boost. All right. Probably the time to forfeit, but uh, we'll see. We'll see how this goes here. We'll play, we'll play the next touch. How are we feeling, Barney? Oh, big. Pick the one-on-one, -on -one, Barney. You play ones. Barney plays ones. Ooh, Barney does not play ones. All right, yeah, probably not scoring four goals in 40 seconds. I feel comfortable forfeiting if Barney wants to. That's valid. You can't win them all. Can't win them all. But yeah, I hope this series is helpful for you guys. Truly, like, let me know down in the comments if you enjoy this type of content where I'm just kind of commentating my own games and talking about decisions I'm making and stuff like that. Obviously, we don't always win, and so I'll probably, I'll probably still include that game because I want, you, I kind of, I don't know. It's you want to you learn from your wins and your losses. It's really important to look at every game as just trying to get better instead of trying to win or lose. I think for me, that can help a lot with improvement. Let me know what you guys think of this series down in the comments below. I read every comment. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on the next video. But uh, other than that, I think that's all I got for you guys. I hope you know that Jesus loves you and so do I. We'll see you in the next one.